हेलो माय डियर स्टूडेंट वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल थैंक्स फॉर सपोर्टिंग मी एंड फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल विश यू आर वेरी हैप्पी न्यू ईयर सो प्लीज स्टे विथ मी स्टे होम एंड स्टे हैप्पी इफ यू लाइक माय वीडियो देन प्लीज शेयर दिस वीडियो विद योर फ्रेंड्स एंड इफ यू आर न्यू व्यूअर देन प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल एंड प्लेस द Okay so let's start So today I'm going to start exercise 19E from the book of S Chand So here problem number 1 Find the number of sides of a regular polygon in which each interior angle is 162 Now you know that uh, the sum of interior and exterior angle that equal to 180 degree So if interior angle equal to 162 then exterior angle equal to 180 minus 162 and that equal to 18 degree and here the formula to find out number of sides the formula will be 360 degree by exterior angle so that means 360 degree by 18 degree that equal to 20 degree sum number 2 how many sides has a polygon the sum of whose interior angle is 1980 So here the formula, the sum of interior angles that equal to n minus 2 into 180 degree, and it's given that the sum of interior angle that equal to 1980. So according to the problem, n minus 2 into 180 that equal to 1980, and from that n equal to 13. Sum number three, the angles of a quadrilateral taken in order as 2x, 3x, 7x, and 8x. Find x and prove that. two positive opposite sides are parallel so you know that the sum of all interior angles of a quadrilateral that equal to 360 degree so here 2x plus 3x plus 7x plus 8x that equal to 360 and from that x equal to 18 degree so that is the value of x so that means all the angles are 2 into 18 36 3 into 18 54 7 into 18 126 and 8 into 18 144 now if uh, this uh, four are the angles of a quadrilateral and this one 36 and this one 150 144 so 36 plus 144 that equal to 180 degree okay now the angles of two sides the angles of two side if the sum of these two angles equal to 180 degree that means this side and this side will be parallel so it's proved sum number 4 a b c d e a b c d e are regular pentagon ab and dc produced to meet at point p then find the angle of b p c so here sum of interior angles that equal formula n minus 2 into 180 degree and has uh, as it is a pentagon that means n equal to 5 so 5 minus 2 equal to 180 that equal to 540 Now each interior angle equal to 540 by 5 that equal to 108. So that means this angle equal to 108. This angle equal to 108. So if this one 108, then this one equal to 72 degree. And if this one equal to 108, 108. So this one also 72 degree. Now in this triangle BPC, BPC is a triangle. So in this triangle, these two sides, sorry, these two angles. Are seventy two degree, so the rest angle equal to one eighty minus seventy two plus seventy two, and that equal to thirty six degree. Sum number five. Find the sum of the interior angles of a polygon which has thirty sides. So sum of interior angle formula equal to n minus two, that means thirty minus two into one eighty, and that equal to five zero four zero. Now five zero four zero means fifty six into ninety, so that equal to fifty six right angle. Now sum number six. Sum of uh sorry sum number 6 prove that the sum of the interior angles of an octagon is twice the sum of the interior angles of a pentagon so first you have to find out the sum of interior angles of an octagon so here the formula n equal to 8 so n minus 2 that means 8 minus 2 into 180 and that equal to 1080 and sum of interior angles of pentagon pentagon that means n equal to 5 So five minus two into one eighty is equal to five fifty. So if you double five fifty, five fifty into two, then you will get one zero eight zero. That means it proved that uh, the sum of interior angles of a octagon is equal to the double of the sum of interior angle of a pentagon. So it's proved. So here sum number seven. 
in a regular pentagon a b c d e calculate the number of degrees in the angle a b c and prove that b c parallel a d so here uh, a b c d is a pentagon and each interior angle equal to 108 okay uh, each interior angle equal to 108 uh, you know how to find out the interior angles of a pentagon so now in this triangle a e d in this triangle a e d uh, this angle equal to 108 and these two sides will be equal that means this angle and this angle will be equal and uh, you can easily find out the value of this angle so that equal to 36 degree now next one if this one equal to 36 degree uh, so this one equal to 108 minus 36 that equal to 72 degree so as well as this one equal to also 72 degree now here uh, you have to prove that uh, ad parallel bc so to prove that ad parallel bc you have to show that these two angle equal to 180 so here dab dab equal to 72 and angle b equal to 108 so 72 plus 108 that equal to 180 so it's proved that ad parallel bc sub number eight is it possible to draw a regular polygon with exterior angle so here uh, the formula to find out the side that equal to 360 by 72 that means 360 by exterior angle so 360 by 72 that equal to 5 so first one is yes second one uh, here n equal to 360 by 32 and that equal to 11.25 that means a decibel fraction so it not possible second one third one yes so in this way you can find out the uh, rest, rest one now uh, sum number 82 in sum number 82 is it possible to draw a regular polygon with interior angles so at first here the given interior angle equal to 120 degree so first you have to find out the exterior angle and that equal to 180 minus 120 that equal to 60 degree now if n equal to a whole number then it possible but if n equal to a fraction or a decimal fraction then it will not possible sum number 9 the number of sides of two regular polygons are in the ratio 3 is to 2 and their interior angles are in the ratio 5 is to 3 so if ratio of two sides of two polygon that equal 3 is to 2 so number of sides of first polygon that is 3x and number of sides of second polygon that equal to 2x here x is a proportional constant that is not equal to 0 now the sum of interior angles of the first polygon the formula will be 3x minus 2 that means n minus 2 into 180 and second one sum of interior angles of second polygon that equal to 2x minus 2 into 180 now as it's given that the ratio of the interior angle equal to 5 is to 3 that means this one divided by this one you will get 5 by 3 so 180 180 cancel out then cross multiply and you will find out x equal to 4 so if constant equal to 4 then here 3 is to 2 that means 3x and 2x so 4 into 3 that equal to 12 and 4 into 2 that equal to 8 so number of sides of first polygon is 12 and number of side of second polygon that equal to 8 sum number 10 the sides of a pentagon are produced in order and the exterior angle so obtained measured 2x plus 20, x minus 10, 3x plus 30, 4x minus 15 and 5x minus 10. So first you have to find out the measure of x and then find all the exterior angles of the pentagon. So here the sum of the interior angles, sorry the sum of the exterior angles of a pentagon that equal to 360. So uh, 2x plus 20 plus x minus 10 plus 3x minus 30 plus 4x minus 15 plus 5x minus 10 that equal to 360 and from this equation you can easily find out the value of x and that equal to 23 so if the value of x equal to 23 then just put down this value here first 23 into 2 plus 20 that equal to 66 second one 23 minus 10 that equal to 13 third one 3 into 23 plus 30 that equal to 99 so you will get all the value of the exterior angles now sum number 11 in sum number 11 the ratio between the interior and exterior angles of a regular polygon that equal to 8 is to 1 so here interior angle equal to 8x and exterior angle equal to 1x or x 
Now you know the addition or the summation of interior and exterior that equal to 180. So 8x plus x that equal to 180. So here x equal to 20 degree. So if x equal to 20 degree then interior angle is equal to 8 into 20 160 and exterior angle equal to 20 degree that is the first answer. Now second one you have to find out each exterior angle of the polygon. So formula n equal to uh, sorry uh, oh sorry that is the second one. Now you have to find out the number of sides the number of sides of the regular polygon. So here the formula n equal to 360 by exterior angle and that equal to 18. So number of sides equal to 18. Sub number 12. An octagon has two pairs of equal angles, one measuring 72 and other 56. That means there are two 72 angles and there are two 56 degree angles and four equal angles. So first let each equal angle be x. So 2 into 72 and 2 into 56 plus 4x that equal to the sum of interior angles of a octagon. So here the formula n minus 2 that means 8 minus 2 into 180. So uh, 144 plus 112 plus 4x equal to 1080 and from that x equal to 206. So that means the value of each equal angle that equal to 206. Sum number 13. Each exterior angle of a regular polygon is two thirds of its interior angle. Find the number of sides in the regular polygon. So let interior angle be x then exterior angle equal to 2x by 3 as two third of the interior angle. So x plus 2x by 3 that equal to 180 and from that x equal to 108. So if x equal to 108 then exterior angle equal to 2 into 108 by 3 that means 72. So if exterior angle equal to 72 then number of side equal to 360 by 72 and that equal to 5. Sub number 14. Each interior angle of a regular polygon is 160. Find the interior angle of a regular polygon which has double the number of side as the given polygon. So here interior angle equal to 160. Then first you have to find out the exterior angle. So here ex exterior angle equal to 180 minus 160 that equal to 20 degree. So the number of sides equal to formula 360 by exterior angle and that equal to 18. Okay. Now next thing if the side of the first polygon that equal to 18 then the number of side of the new polygon or the second polygon that equal to double so 18 into 2 that equal to 36. Now you have to find out the x sorry the interior angle of this polygon which are having 36 sides. So exterior angle of the new polygon that equal to 360 by number of sides and that equal to 10. So interior angle equal to 180 minus 10 and that equal to 170 degree. Now sum number 15 that is the last problem in this sum sorry in this exercise. So I hope uh, you like this video please please share this video and I need your support. So please share this video with your friends and tell them to subscribe my channel as uh, we are very uh, close uh, to 1000 subscribers so thank you so much now here uh, 15 two interior angles of a polygon are right angles and sum of the remaining angles is 172 so here two interior angles of a polygon is 90 degree that means first 190 second 190 and the sum of remaining angle is equal to 120 so that is the sum of whole interior angles and you know the formula n minus 2 into 180. So here 900 equal to n minus 2 into 180. So n minus 2 equal to 900 by 180 that equal to 5. So n equal to 7. That means the number of side of the polygon equal to 7. Okay. So here exercise 19 uh, e. Okay. Uh, fully solve out. So I hope uh, there is no problem. So please. Uh, share this channel with your friends and tell them to subscribe. Okay. Thank you.